Here we go, back again with another video. And yes, I did say I would pop back on later on after I've looked more into this, what do you call them, the fans together group. The fans together group, the cryptocurrency group that are looking to purchase Stuart Donalds and Charlie Metvin's shares. But since the tweet that went on to Tom White's Twitter account to do with this news coming forward today, KLD, Kirill Louis-Dreyfus has been interviewed or made a statement to the Northern Echo. Now, Kirill Louis-Dreyfus says, Sunderland owner Kirill Louis-Dreyfus has addressed the talks between the club's shareholders and the cryptocurrency group, the fans together, regarding the purchase of Stuart Donald and Charlie Meffin's shares and appears to have distanced himself from the potential buyers. Method and Donald, who owned by combined share of 39% share of the club, have accepted an offer last week from an unnamed party for their shares, with the sale expected to go through before the start of the championship campaign. The Northern Echo received a statement from the fans together today to confirm that they were discussing with the pair. In a statement, Louis Dreyfus says, Juan Santori and I remain wholeheartedly committed to Sunday FC. And our collective focus is on preparing for the upcoming championship season. Neither I nor any employee at SAFC have had any dialogue with the cryptocurrency group, the fans together. And although a timely conclusion to the matter is preferable, any transfer of shares must not compromise the club's integrity. All shareholders must also be qualified to take the club forward in line with the EFL's governance and have alignment with the values and principles of SAFC and its supporters, as well as a long-term strategy. So there we go, KLD apparently is not happy with the whole situation, has distanced himself away from this. So, as I said before, Sartori and KLD his families are really close. I think Madrox got KLD in through the connections with Satori. Now, Satori has distanced himself away from Donald and Metvin over the last few months and has lined up with KLD. So if they have, that means they will have 61% shares between the two of them. So Donald and Metvin want to sell their shares. Now, why do Donald and Metvin want to sell to a, a group that seems to have no funds? Surely there's better options out there who will pay more money than this option of this fans together group there's got to be better options out there and if donald now if donald wanted to sell his shares ages ago like he, said he did when he said he was unwelcome he would have moved on now what now the thing that <clears throat> leave a bit of taste in my mouth of the whole situation right i don't like medfin and i don't like donald i don't hate them but i don't like them I want to sell the shares to somebody who could come in with backing and money behind them. Someone like the, like the Ineos group, like the American group with Dell. Somebody with a bit of money behind them. We don't want someone to come in who has nothing, nothing at all to give to the club. Like this football cryptocurrency have nothing. Donald Miffin have more money than this group. So to me, what is the point of these buying the club? Are these buying the club so that they can make money, piggyback on top to make money off the fans or make money like Donald and Mifflin have done? Now, what leaves a bit of taste in my mouth, if, if KLD is not happy with the whole situation, why doesn't he buy the full amount of shares from the club? Why not? Why doesn't Sartori purchase the full amount of shares of Donald and Mifflin? Why don't these two club together with the backing of his mother and his partner and her partner, sorry, and buy the club outright. If they're not happy, do something about it, KLD. Do something about it. Spend your money, get the whole club for yourself. The fans will come on board. All the fans will come on board if you get us out of this hole. Now, I can't see how someone like this cryptocurrency football fans together group could outbid someone like KLD and Sartori with their connections, with their wealth in their families. So I don't understand. I just do not understand why 
why KLD will not purchase the club. When he says, this is what he says. Where, where's that again? It's down here. Yes, yeah, something to do with having the club at heart. I've read it out once just there now. I remain whole, wholeheartedly committed, wholeheartedly committed to SAFC and our collective focus in preparing for the upcoming championship. Why wouldn't you buy the whole of the club? If you have the club at heart, you can afford it. Clearly you can afford it. This Mickey Mouse Corporation. Surely this is not right. Surely this, ha this, has, got to be, this has got to be an absolute April Fool's joke. It's got to be bollocks. I do not want these to take over. I do not want Myth and Dunlop to sell the shares. I would rather have that. I'd rather have William Story buy the shares with his consortium than have these buy the shares. That is just my point. That is just my opinion. And I think it's got to be bollocks. It's got to be bollocks. The EFL will no way let these take over those shares. They shouldn't be allowed to pass the the, the fit and proper tests by the EFL. They should not be allowed to pass that. If they are allowed to pass that, EFL are not doing their job. I'm disappointed. I am disappointed. It really disappointed in KLD and Sartori if they don't purchase these shares. I, I just... I, I, I just, just when you think you're getting somewhere. Just when you think you're getting somewhere. You know... You get a good owner, you get, you get, you know, a decent owner like KLD in, that we thought. So Tori seems to come out of, of the Madrox, gone over to KLD. We're going to get rid of Donald and Medfin. We get promoted. Alex Neal, everything's looking rosy for succeeding to, to progress to the championship and do better. And then we get 28,000. I mean, that's, that's amazing. 28,000. 28,000 season cards have sold. We've got 28,000 season ticket, season card holders at our club. We're going to surpass 30,000. And then this bombshell comes out, puts a spanner in the works. Why is it always Sunderland? I just hope it's bollocks. Right, thanks for watching the video. Please subscribe to the channel. It'll be much appreciated out there. If you can subscribe to the channel, I'll be over the moon. But I do not want this to happen. And KLD, Sartori, come on. Put your money where your mouth is. Buy the full amount of shares of the club and completely own this club and take them forward. Thanks for watching the video. Take care. God bless me. Go, go with your muff down to bed. See you later.